Often negative emotions are caused by negative thoughts or our negative thinking patterns. These voices in our heads, which everyone has, usually go unnoticed. They're just there in the background, uh, an almost kind of self-talk always going on. This voice can sometimes be our worst enemy. It can judge us, criticise, compare, worry or dwell on things that happened in the past. They're normally not about what's happening right now, but usually planning things that might happen in the future or things that happened in the past. These thoughts are also usually accompanied by visual images too. To be fused with our thoughts means that we see the world through these thoughts. We get caught up in them. We believe what they say. On the other hand, to be defused from them means that we see them for just what they are. They're just thoughts. They're words passing through our heads. In order to become more diffused from your thoughts means that you're less likely to have ex experienced negative emotion as a result of having those thoughts because you just see them as thoughts passing from your head and nothing more. You don't believe what they are saying. So in order to do this, you can try a technique called I'm having the thought that. So what this means is that firstly, you take an example, a sentence of a negative thought that you're having. So you could be having the thought that my best friend hates me. You could say my friend hates me, my friend hates me. At first you need to get caught up in this. So try for 10 seconds really believing that thought. Say it over and over again in your head and see the world through that thought. My friend hates me, my friend hates me, she must be really angry at me, she must hate me, she must not like me, I must have annoyed her. You could easily become very caught up in that and see how that could become inflict negative emotion on you. On the other hand, if you then change that sentence to, I'm having a thought that my friend hates me. What that does is by labeling it as I'm having a thought, it takes away the meaning behind it. You no longer see the world as my friend hates me and believe that as truth. It's I'm having the thought that my friend hates me. It's a thought. It's just passing through my mind. It's not the truth or it's not definite. It's just my perception of the world that's just popped up in my head and it doesn't mean that it's true. It takes away the power that the words have. Now you can try that with some examples yourself. So first of all, take your thought and get caught up in it for 10 seconds and then start to label it as I'm having a thought and notice a difference. So next time you find yourself worried, getting caught up, having really negative thoughts, just try and label them. I'm having the thought that and see if you can diffuse yourself or separate yourself from the power that those thoughts are having on you.